acts of atonement to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. O Sacred Heart of Jesus, humbly prostrate before you, we come to renew our consecration with the resolution of repairing by an increase of love and fidelity toward you all the outrages unceasingly offered to you. We solemnly promise the more your mysteries are blasphemed, the more firmly we will believe in them, O Sacred Heart of Jesus. The more impiety endeavors to extinguish our hopes of immortality, the more we will trust in your heart, sole hope of mortals. The more hearts resist your divine attractions, the more we will love you, O infinitely amiable Heart of Jesus. The more your divinity is attacked, the more we will adore it, O Divine Heart of Jesus. The more your holy laws are forgotten and transgressed, the more we will observe them, O Most Holy Heart of Jesus. The more your sacraments are despised and abandoned, the more we will receive them with love and respect, O Most Liberal Heart of Jesus. The more your adorable virtues are forgotten, the more we will endeavor to practice them, O heart, model of every virtue, the more the devil labors to destroy souls, the more we will be inflamed with desire to save them, O heart of Jesus, zealous lover of souls. The more pride and sensuality tend to destroy abnegation and love of duty, the more generous we will be in overcoming ourselves, O heart of Jesus. Jesus. Make us such true apostles of your heart that reparation to you may be our best reward. Amen. Good Jesus, who alone orders all things well, I cast myself on your infinite, undeserved love. I trust you with all of my heart, myself, and all who I love, and all that I desire, my present and my future, my hopes and my fears, my time and my eternity, my joys and my sorrows. Deal with me as you will, and know best, only bind me safe to your everlasting love. Second Act of Atonement O adorable heart of my Savior and my God, penetrated with a lively sorrow at the sight of the outrages which you have received and which you daily receive in the sacrament of your love, behold me prostrate at the foot of your altar to make an acceptable atonement. Oh, that I were able by my homage and veneration to make satisfaction to your injured honor and efface with my tears and with my blood so many irreverences, profanations, and sacrileges which outrage your infinite greatness. How well should my life be disposed of could it be sacrificed for so worthy an object? Pardon, divine Savior, my ingratitude and all the infidelities and indignities which I have committed against your Sovereign Majesty. Remember that your adorable heart, bearing the weight of my sins in the days of its mortal life, was sorrowful, even unto death. Do not suffer your agony and your blood to be unprofitable to me. Annihilate within me my criminal heart, and give me one according to yours, a heart contrite and humble a heart pure and spotless, a heart which may be from now on a victim consecrated to your glory and inflamed with the sacred fire of your love. O Lord, I deplore in the bitterness of my heart my former irreverences and sacrileges which I wish in future to repair by my pious deportment in the churches, my assiduity in visiting and my devotion and fervor in receiving the most holy sacrament of the altar. But in order to render my respect and my adoration more grateful to you, I unite them with those which are rendered to you in our temples by those blessed spirits who are at the foot of your sacred tabernacles. Hear their vows, O my God, and accept the homages of a heart which returns to you with the sole view of loving only you that I may merit loving you eternally. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.